Hey, I'm Harper, your Hopper Helper. In this video, I'll show you ways to deal with your hopper if during the installation, it's been stuck on the Blue 015 pop-up for more than 10 minutes. Depending on why this happened, we have a quick solution and a longer solution. Let's try the quick solution first. Using the SysInfo button on the front panel, open the hopper system info screen. You're looking for a dash FM dash next to the software version's four characters. If you see this, you get the easy solution. Woohoo! If not, wait just a minute or two for the longer form solution. Exit the system info screen by selecting Close. On the front panel, press Menu. Select Settings. Select Factory Defaults. On pop up, select Yes. Now the hopper resets. That's it for the easy path. You people that saw the dash FM dash in the system info screen can finish the installation. You don't have to watch anymore. I'd recommend watching the video Hopper and Joey installs the happy path for how the install should work though. It's different than the previous Dish Network installations. For the rest of you, let's continue. Your issue needs the old school way to get back to the receiver setup wizard. This will look a tad familiar. First, if you need to get back to the 015 pop-up, you can exit the system info screen by selecting close or you can reset the receiver. While you see the 015 pop-up, press menu on the front panel. Select Settings, select Point Dish, select Check Switch, select Test. When the results come back, ensure they match your installation and then select Save. You may briefly see pop-up 378. Using the SysInfo button on the front panel, open the Hopper System Info screen, then use the front panel to move to and select Close. Pop-up 015 displays, but it will finish and move into the Receiver Setup Wizard. Follow the on-screen prompts to finish the installation from here. You're all set. Take care, and I hope to not see you soon. And you know I mean that in a nice way, right?